Businesses are fed up in New York City. Businesses are fed up in New York. Check this out. Here's a bonus. The governor of New York, the governor of New York, I'm going to share something with you what the governor of New York said about what happened with Trump. Before I do, just really quickly, again, this sets a, a an alarm. Every homeowner, every property owner, every American should be extremely, extremely upset and alarmed by this. It has nothing to do with liking Trump. It has nothing to do with hating Trump. It has nothing to do with Republican, Democrat, blue, right, left, red, whatever. Blue pill, red pill has nothing to do with that. This is just looking at the facts, the actual data. And this is dangerous. This is extremely dangerous. Um, aspiring, it, it, it's, it's, you know, it's, it also sets my, my kids, you know, my kids are, it just, my kids' generation, what's it say to them? You work your butt off, blood, sweat, and tears. You reach a height of success. And if you don't align with governmental or uh, establishment uh, views, both politically, socially, what have you, you're going to be taken out. You're going to be taken out. You're going to be, you're going to be uh, uh, bankrupted by the system because you don't align and you don't uh, agree with our, the establishment's political views. That's what this, this is the precedent that's being set here. And the more they throw everything in the kitchen sink at this guy, what's happening? People are waking up. That's the purpose of this channel. The purpose of this channel. I'm risking a ton. My wife is not happy with me. Okay, I've got businesses. I was happy. I was comfortable. But I love my country. I can't take this anymore. I have to bring this up. I have to talk about this. We have to talk about it. This is how we fight back. Leaving comments. You guys sharing these videos. Watching these videos. This is how we fight back. It's got nothing to do with blue right. It has to do with loving our beautiful, amazing United States of America country and the founding documents, the founding fathers, the founding principles, the Ten Commandments, the Bill of Rights, the Constitution. These are ironclad documents, time immemorial. They will not rust. They shall not rust, but they can be corrupted. And this is a dereliction of duty. This is a absolute rebuke to their oath that they that they uh, 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 signed off on that they actually ascribe to this is a this is a deviation a dereliction of their oath of office to uphold the constitution this is not constitutional one iota to even prove i think even more this is very very telling i'd love to hear your thoughts on this to even show more that this is something that is a complete political witch hunt and it's a weaponization of the justice system and it has nothing to do with actual law and order listen to what governor of new york i want to say her name right governor of new york kathy hochul Listen to this. Governor Kathy Hochul tells New York businesses not to fear about Trump verdict. Nothing to worry about. I think this is really, listen to this. Watch this. I think this is really this is so unbelievable that they're coming out with this. I think that this is really an extraordinary, unusual circumstance that the law-abiding and rule-following New Yorkers who are business people have nothing to worry about because they're different than Donald Trump and his behavior. Governor Hochul responded. Excuse me? So in other words, um, you don't have to worry about other, if your name is not Donald Trump and you conduct business in New York City, if you're not running for president, uh, if you're not aiming to uh, uproot the establishment and drain the swamp and actually fight for America, don't worry about it. You'll be fine. We're just going after him. Isn't that just an admission of that? That's an admission of that, is it not? Again, what am I missing? I'm happy to be wrong. Prove me wrong in the comments. I respond to all the comments personally. At least I try very, very hard to. There's sometimes too many and I can't get to all of them. I apologize. But I try my hardest. This sets a dangerous precedent. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. What do you guys think? Um, the more we raise awareness, as I said, the better we can fight back. That is the purpose of my channel. It's to bridge the divide, not to expand the divide. It's not about right, left. It's not about Democrat, Republican. It's not about uh, uh, any of that stuff. This is about coming together, looking at things critically, 
understanding what is the objective truth so we can make better decisions about our beautiful country moving forward. Um, so I, I hope you will join us. I hope you will join me and continue to watch these videos, like these videos, share these videos. Uh, make sure if you've made it this far, in the pinned comment is our free, it's absolutely free, our free newsletter. This is your, because they're going to delete this channel. They're going to delete all these channels because all of these platforms are run by, uh, you know, known censors, people who love to censor people like me. But by subscribing to our newsletter, you'll never miss out. And it's absolutely free. We don't share your email. We don't spam. Literally, it's just your way to always be in the know. So make sure you do that. It's in the pinned comment and the description. Sign up. It's absolutely free. Do that below. Make sure you check out these videos right here. These videos are going to take you deeper. They're awesome videos. I think you'll enjoy them uh, immensely. Subscribe and follow down there. Like, comment, and share. As always, God bless the United States of America. God bless you. And I'll see you soon.